On Thursday, November 10th, protests erupted on UT's campus as a response to the 2016 presidential election results. One protester, Mickey Shelton, who was receiving a lot of attention, even dressed up as president-elect Donald Trump. I wanted to voice my First Amendment uh, you know, rights, my opinions, and I'm just trying to be civil. You know, I'm, I'm trying to uh, listen to other people's perspectives. Uh, you know, we're all on the same plane right now. I, I just don't want us all to crash. At the end of the day, we're all Americans. We just believe in different solutions to the same problems. I just want to come together. Both opinions matter. Their opinion, her opinion. But they say only one opinion. They've thrown my wig off. They've cussed me out, cut me off, and I've been civil this whole time. I want to open a dialogue. Open a dialogue. However, not all students seem to agree that Shelton is encouraging a civil conversation. There's people that come to this campus all the time to basically just rile up the students. And I think the fact that he's here along the, along the anti-elect Trump uh, protest is kind of adding fuel to the fire. James also expressed her frustration with the lack of UT administration at the protest. They should at least acknowledge it. Like, oh wow, it's cool to have a couple of emails, but actions speak louder than words. Like, maybe have like those safe space things that they keep talking about. I don't see them. I don't see them at all. The whole protest lasted more than five hours and saw a turnout of roughly more than 100 students and faculty. Reporting for the Daily Beacon, my name is Aldaf Nanavari.